Hi everybody, Patrick here from Engineering Shock Electronics. Uh, if you've been watching my videos, I've been uh, posting all of my Verilog experiments. I recently picked up a Mojo FPGA board featuring a Spartan FPGA. Lots of fun, uh, very frustrating, but lots of fun at the same time. Uh, specifically because I'm so used to sequential code and um, Verilog hardware, hardware, um, uh, hardware languages is a. Uh, <laughs> it's been a, it's been a challenge, but it's been a lot of fun. Thanks again uh, to my friend Mark for uh, giving me tips and pointers. Um, this code is essentially just a keypad based uh, LED, like it'll show it will, the LEDs on the board right here will show me what what button is being pressed. I'll give you a uh, uh, a close up of the LEDs in a minute, but essentially one, two in binary, three uh, A, uh, and uh, four, five, six. B. I should say binary and hex if you're looking at it. Uh, really, it's in hex. Uh, seven, eight, nine, C. Uh, this should be. I think I've assigned E to star, zero to zero, and F to uh, the number sign, pound, and D to D. So I'll give you. I'll just clear it by pressing zero, and I'll give you a closer look. On closer inspection, I made a, a small error in my case. Uh, in the code, so uh, it's actually so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, A, B, C, D. Now, I've, if I press the star, it should be uh, E, but I think I made a mistake in the case, so it's just going to show me D when I press that. Uh, F when I press star, that's fine, and zero when I press zero. So I have to change that, obviously, but I did want to share. Uh, I like documenting projects like this. Even if it's, I'm not making escape room props or other electronic devices for customers, I still like to uh, document my own projects so I can look back. Uh, over the years, there have been th more than a thousand videos on this channel, I think, So, uh, although many of them are private. Um, but thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to uh, learn along with me, feel free to message. I'll see you about... Uh, putting the code up on Engineering Shock Electronics uh, in the near future. Uh, until that happens, I'm just going to con continue to design these, these fun projects and uh, post them on YouTube. Thanks for watching, everyone.